Hey, how you doing? Vinny, Rover Specialist. Today we're working on 2013 Range Rover, full-size autobiography, big boy. Um, car comes in and has uh, lights on and it says coolant. They overheated it, running funny. So we're gonna check it out. Um, put the computer on it, run through some codes, check some stuff. Let's see how many miles, what's the miles on this car? 8,000 miles. So we ran the codes, checked the codes, found out some misfire codes in there, cleared everything out, ran it again, and it came back with these codes again. Um, I have an issue with the cam correlation codes, the position, uh, ran the misfires, that came back on two times. Now it sounds kind of loud or whatever, but we run a couple simple tests, run through it, and we're gonna check to see if the head gasket's bad or any damage. So what I use is this, very simple. Blue liquid turns to green, and you put it inside the coolant tank. So there's the blue liquid. Now all you do is put it on the tank, coolant tank, like this. Then all it checks is if there's, if there's exhaust gases coming back into the coolant, which it shouldn't be. It should be going after the exhaust. If it comes back, that means somewhere in the engine is either a crack or head gaskets bad. So we're going to start it up and see how long it takes. <laughs> Ready, you can hear it running bad. Um, it could be one of many things why it's running bad. It could be injectors, it could be spark plugs could be whatever but it's very loud and we're just gonna run in a second or two see how long it takes for the bubbles to come through there because if it is making pressure uh, back pressure from the engine I'm gonna push it into the cooling system there you go it didn't have a good seal so it immediately turned green it's blown back a lot of pressure that means there's definitely engine issue so if you want to get it checked out have it done right and simple. And you can spend a lot less money checking the car if you know what you're doing. Rover Specialist, out.